what is going on everybody welcome back it's your boy worst heaven gamer and today i'm crazy excited to bring you guys another awakening it's our home girl adeline is about to be awakened guys so without any further ado drop a like let's get right into it because i really want to awaken her i'm excited about this right now i can't freaking wait so let's go ahead let's head over to part number two all right so for her second quest you got to do bountiful caverns six times i'm already at Four, I mean five and six, so we're just gonna sweep this get it out of the way. Let's go. Oh Man, this is exciting guys. I have been waiting for this for a while because I didn't use my celestial potion for her I had to do it the long way and um, It actually feel like I really worked for it this time man Took forever, but we're finally there guys. Wait a minute. I didn't read what part number three All right, this one without anybody dying. Okay. These are the easy ones All right, let's go ahead who are we gonna use? Let's just go with Batman. Um, do -do -do -do. Right, whatever. These stages are pretty easy at this point in the game for me, but I'll just use these heroes for now. Strike when the moment is right. Okay, girl. Mm, I can't wait for the transformation. Uh, as you guys already know, I use her all the time in my arena, guys. Like she's definitely in my epic arena teams, and I use her in my main arena teams. Quite often, depending on what the matchups are, uh, when you need to get rid of backliners, uh, Magnus, any stationary backliners, she's a beast. Uh, the further away she is from the target, the more damage she does. So don't forget that, guys. She's, she, she thrives at heroes that are further away. So it's really, really good. And check out this ultimate right here. So she transforms, digits her strings, and then dish dashes out to the backfield and just starts pounding them. Pow, pow! Pow, pow! So, like I said, it's an exciting character. Um, I'm not sure what... I'm not, I don't recall what my last couple of Awakened heroes were, but I'm pretty sure it was some of the latest heroes. Uh, let's see. Alicia and some of those heroes that I don't use as much in my main arena team. So, this one is a little more exciting because, like I said, I use her all the time. So, I'm going to take advantage of this Awakening. I just hope it's a good one. All right, here we are, guys. Here we are. Get in your seats, strap on tight, let's see this transformation. Let's go! Ow! Oh, what the? Man! Wow! Hold on. That shadow is ridiculous. That's too sick. Wow. I love the shadow, but she hasn't changed that much, though. She got the horns. That's pretty cool, and her attire changed a little bit. But it wasn't a complete crazy transformation, but the card is a lot different, though. Wow. The card definitely looks a lot different. I uh, don't remember if she has silver hair. No, she doesn't. In her avatar, her hair... Man, her hair is black. And here, it's silver. I think it would have been a lot better if her hair was silver. Oh, it kind of did change a little bit there. As you can see, it's from purple to kind of like gray. Okay, okay. Let's see what this ultimate is all about, boys. Uh, resilience. Every time she takes a certain amount of damage, indicated by a piece of breaking off. Okay, Adeline will increase her attack, speed, and magic crit rating. Ha! Yo, that is dope. Okay, that is a sick ability right there because it actually makes her a lot better. Wow. Wowzers, Bowsers! Oh, that's incredible. Yep. Alright, I'm gonna spend some diamonds here, guys. I don't give a damn. I'm gonna blow some diamonds just to level her up here. All the way. Okay, here we go. Magic crit increased by 240 when Adeline takes damage. Damn. So, her attack speed and magic crit rating. That's dope. That's a nice increase right there. That's a really, really nice increase, guys. Now, we have ruins opened anyways. Uh, physical attack. Damn it. Max health. Should I give her max health? Uh, yes. Why not? I'm going to give it to her. And I don't have anything there. Boy, that's not good. I got to create one. All right, boys. Let's go do what we normally do. Oh, that's Forge. Ah, what did you expect? Something different? That's right, guys. We're going to Forge. But since Adeline has been out for a while already, her academy is already done. She's maxed out. She's enchanted. Everything else is pretty much maxed out. Only the Forge needs to be maxed out, pretty much. And then she's ready to go, guys. So after this, I'm going to take her in a main arena battle so I can show you how she does in the arena. If you don't already know, she's a killer beast. And I'll talk about that a little bit later. But let's go ahead, guys. Let's check out these bonuses right now. Uh, 30, 26, 20, yeah, it's okay, it's not that great, but magic attack is where it's at, that's what we need, a magic pierce rating increase, magic health, I mean max health and magic attack, okay, very nice increases, let's go ahead guys, into the arena, 
All right, guys, here we are in the arena now. Let's check it out. Let's see what we're going to do here. I'm actually running uh, Mechanai as well, so you guys can take a look at her because of the event that's going on right now. Well, I got to win as many battles as I can with her on the team, but... Or with him on the team, I mean. I know it's a guy, but let's go ahead and check it out what's going on with Adeline here. So if you can see in the background, she's dealing a lot of the damage to the backline heroes here, and it's incredible. I uh, don't even... Wow, I didn't even need any ultimates for this battle at all because she did everything. Woo, boom. Oh, Batman is going to destroy her. Yup, didn't even kill him. Wow. Look at Elric go, guys. Sometimes Elric surprises you, but uh, doesn't mean he's one of the best tier tanks in the game, guys. All right, so check it out. Damage output. Boy, her damage was not that great. But don't, don't sleep on that, guys. It doesn't matter. She's got a lot of other great abilities that are outside of her damage it's not just damage on her um you know what i mean let's go back and check her out right now all right guys so here we are so just to let you guys know what else she does if you don't already have her so breaking free is her ultimate uh, like you saw before she breaks out of her uh puppet you know strings and then she's free she goes into the back line does some damage and uh this is great as well guys because she's immune to the majority of control abilities which means she cannot be controlled and that's really really good uh it's a great ability there uh magic bolt this just does a lot of damage to the furthest enemy like i said before the greater the distance the more damage that she does and then uh it also slows them down which is you know another great one there with the Song of Chaos, uh, she takes some health and some energy from your opponent and also deals some damage. So, another damage dealing ability. Um, Spike Strike, it's also, this is another damage dealing ability. Most of her abilities, guys, are all single target damage. So, that's why you don't see her as sometimes she's not the highest dealing um, hero in the game. Whenever you use her, you're like, wait a minute, she didn't even do that much damage. But, sometimes that's confusing, guys. Don't confuse damage for how strong a hero is because... A lot of heroes that do AoE damage will rack up a lot more damage points. So, you, so their damage points are a lot higher. But in terms, they didn't really do that much damage. Uh, she does single target damage, so she can destroy a hero within two or three hits. Thus making her a lot more valuable. So, you know, it depends on what kind of lineup you want to run with her. But she's a great single target dealing uh, hero. Hits all backliners. The further, the better. And uh, she's amazing. You know what I mean? She dodges control abilities as well, so... Uh, a lot of great things to love about Adeline, and now I'm so happy I got her awakened. I'm going to use her a lot more, uh, you know, obviously in the streams. And uh, that's pretty much it, guys. So I'm going to end this off here. I will catch you guys on another Soul Hunters video. Till then, have a good morning, good afternoon, and good night, peace. Peace!